Question. Why is the virus suddenly spreading after they mandate the wearing of face masks and test everybody left, right and centre with a test that's 80% inaccurate? Who's talking about fear? Who's talking about fear? Do you think I'm scared? Not this guy. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. Are you going to charge me? Are you charging me with anything? Okay. 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 Do you have Yeah, I do. A blow up in the Bunnings car park after he refused to wear a mask. Staff and customers calling police who dished out a fine. The person at Bunnings who won't wear the mask, you know, they'll be happy to have the, the nurse in intensive care wearing a mask when they need help or a loved one needs help. It's just not too much to ask. In the last 24 hours, a stubborn virus proved it will take a lot to budge. 357 new cases in Victoria. Five people have died, aged from their 60s to their 90s. Of the new cases, a member of the Defence Force who caught the virus on the job at a testing facility. Today, colleagues were a show of force, door knocking people with the virus. Good afternoon, how are you? tracing contacts who may have also caught COVID. Melburnians who may have had August 20 circled on the calendar as the day restrictions, including school and work from home, come to an end, may need to think again with infections yet to fall. Today, there were suggestions the city could be in for a much longer lockdown. I don't think we'll be looking at opening up in a, in a couple of weeks necessarily. We flagged that there was a six week you know, minimum expectation. We have to see what it's looking like as we get closer to August 19. The day in this is like a month, I mean that seriously, the only thing we can be beholden to are the numbers. Last night a new ad campaign rolled out across Victorian TV screens. Our daughter is on the front line and she's doing her job. Appealing to a COVID weary population to stay the course. A city where caution is becoming second nature, even if it's an overabundance of it. Lizzie Pearl, Nine News. <laughs> it's just a mask, you guys. Don't be a jerk. It's for the greater good. <laughs>